Danielle, I'm writing this letter with a smile on my face because I'm so excited to see how extra beautiful you will look walking down the aisle towards me. I can't stop thinking about how lucky I am. I would not have been able to do any of what I did without you. Your soul is pure and your heart is big. You're smart and talented. These are exciting times and I want you to try to live in the moment today and try to notice and appreciate all the beautiful details you planned. I love you with all my heart, forever together, Mark. From this day forward, you shall not walk alone. My heart will be your shelter and my arms will be your home. You are my heart. Dear Mark, AKA, my fiance and soon to be husband. Today is our wedding. Congratulations on our marriage. See you at the church at one sharp. Don't be late. Today is gonna to be the best day of our lives. Be in the moment and take it all in. Love your fiance, soon to be wife, XOXO. Mark, you found yourself a wonderful match. But Danielle, I have to say that you're a lucky lady. Mark's eye for the absurd and playful nature will keep you grounded and laughing. His social nature will keep him building your community together. In him, you have a gentle and thoughtful partner who will work for your future and a fellow dreamer as you chart your course together. Uh, Mark and Danielle, we love you. It's a real pleasure for us, Danielle, to have you as an addition to your to our family. It's a real pleasure for us to have your family as an addition to our family. We're, uh, we really love the whole group is. Um, we're proud of you. Your loyalty, generosity, kindness, respect, and love for each other is, is obvious to us. It's been a pleasure to watch as you've evolved over the last six years in your relationship. Find patience and kindness, share comfort and peace, and a love for each other that will only increase. Hold hands, give a hug, listen well to each other, be quick to forgive, be there for one another. The first reading was from the Old Testament. It kind of ends with the beautiful expression, set me like a seal on your heart, like a seal of love upon you. And the final uh, words of that reading, of course, tell us very clearly that love is stronger than death. Nothing can destroy the bonds of love. Jesus once said, only one commandment I give you, love one another as I have loved you. And so we know that today we are all here to support Mark and Danielle on this day and for the rest of their lives. Hi, Danielle. Thank you, Mark. Be my husband all the days of my life. Hi, Mark. Thank you, Danielle, to be my wife. I promise to be true to you all the days of my life.
just before the grace, I just want to uh, say public a very special congratulations to Daniel and Mark and to say, in my 54 years as a priest, I've never um, experienced such organization <laughs> in my life. So, at this time, I wish to share with you some words of wisdom for the newlyweds. Since I am a Trekkie and just love Star Trek, I would simply say to them, live long and prosper. <laughs> Let's keep celebrating the end of their old lives as Daniel Ayres and Mark Kovacs and the beginning of their new lives together as Daniel Ayres and Mark Kovacs. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Wish Danielle and Mark all the happiness in the world. Please raise your glasses to the wonderful bride of one of my best friends, Danielle. Uh, you've always been the man. I'm impressed to see the man you've become. And like, you guys have been working so hard towards your new life. And uh, yeah, I think that about wraps it up. <laughs> Slightly nervous. Well, this is my first time being surrounded by everyone that I love in one spot, and it's pretty amazing. It's hard to imagine what this day is going to be like. I've been dreaming of it since I was a little girl. You know what? It's pretty amazing. So anybody who's not married, I highly recommend doing that.